from Sacred Heart University in Fairfield, Connecticut. This is The Pulse. With a win at home in their season opener against Lafayette, coped with a second victory on enemy turf at Bucknell, and their win at Wagner, the Pios are tied for first place or tied for first place with Brian in NEC standings. The Pioneers defeated Wagner 41 to 14 in a present performance by quarterback Kevin Duke. Okay. A key player for the Pioneers so far this season has been senior running back Jordan Meacham, who has rushed for a total of 386 yards so far this fall. Meacham has shown his quickness and agility through his leadership on the field and has set career highs in the first two games, earning him NEC Offensive Player of the Week after the win against Bucknell. Also keep an eye on rookie running back Julius Chestnut, who earned NEC Rookie of the Week after the Pilots' first victory. Chestnut had an impressive season opener against Lafayette, rushing for a total of 57 yards and scoring two touchdowns. There's no other leader in football and offense like the quarterback. Sacred Heart graduate student Kevin Duke has flashed in both departments from both his running and passing game by being the Pilots' starting quarterback for the last two seasons. Duke is even not afraid to take it into the end zone himself. This rushing touchdown against Lafayette brought the Pilots to a 21-14 lead and then they went on to win 30-14. Duke has recorded 606 passing yards and 173 rushing yards so far this season. Duke had a career high in touchdowns, recording four against Wagner and throwing for 322 yards. Sacred Heart's defense has shown prominent play so far this season. The Pioneers' defense has now held their opponents under 300 yards of total offense in each of their three first games. Defensive lineman Chris Eigenman has been vital to Shu's defense success, recording at least one sack in each of the games played so far. Eigenman earned Defensive Player of the Week for Week 2. Duke and Meacham have been impressive every game so far this season, but it was freshman receiver Nathan Brantley who had a big role along with the upperclassmen at Sacred Heart's win over at Wagner. He rolled in three catches for 118 yards, including two touchdown receptions, one for 45 yards and the other one for 62 yards. Brantley earned NEC Co-Rookie of the Week, while Duke won Offensive Player of the Week. The defense held All-American back Ryan Fulce to 161 net rushing yards and no touchdowns. The Sacred Heart football team was handed its first loss of the season on Saturday afternoon in a 43-24 setback at Cornell. The Pioneers, who had only allowed 34 points through their first three games, surrendered 36 points in the opening half before allowing just 7 points in the second half. Shu had four different players with at least 40 yards receiving, three players with at least 40 yards rushing, and had three players tally their first career touchdowns in the game. On October 6, the Pioneers will return home to Campus Field for homecoming weekend and a breast cancer awareness game against the University of Pennsylvania's Quakers. Sacred Heart has finished in fifth place in the NEC for the past two seasons. After starting at number one, they're looking to continue this momentum to finish at the top of their conference. Back to you, Marissa. Mm -hmm.